Confide, I'm Issa Baza. Welcome to the Sheraton Laguna Guam Resort, your home for the 2015 Miss World Guam pageant. And backdrop for our television special, introducing the lovely local ladies vying for the crown and the opportunity to represent Guam at the international competition. Over the next half hour, we'll be introducing you to the contestants, their motivation behind joining the pageant, their career goals, and how they plan to represent Guam if crowned Miss World Guam 2015. At the end of the show, we'll tell you how you can vote for your favorite contestant online. The contestant with the most votes will be crowned Miss World Guam People's Choice Award, or what we like to call the People's Princess. So there you have it, let's get this show started. Buenas and half a day Guam. My name is Jasmine Marie Guerrero. I am 20 years old, proudly representing Manila, and my charity of choice is the Edward M. Calvo Cancer Foundation. I chose Edward M. Calvo Cancer Foundation because my grandpa, he passed away my senior year from cancer. And it was really hard for me, you know, it took a toll on me, of course. Cancer, it's, it's everywhere. Everybody deals with it. I feel like almost every person I've met has a family member who has cancer and as of right now my my grandma she's actually in Hawaii the Tripler Hospital she's battling breast cancer as well I used to do pageants when I was younger and it was something that my mom got me into you know that you have your pageant mom your dance moms and my mom was definitely something someone who was supportive for that and I enjoyed it I, I was doing it for a really long time probably up until the age of 15 but then I got into sports and that's what I just, through high school, that's what I love to do and I'm, I, I stuck with it. But I always had that in the back of my mind that, oh, you know, I, I wanna be Miss Guam one day. I wanna be an ambassador of my island. I go to the University of Guam and Guam Community College. I, I, do, I do dual enrollment. I'm a major in communication, specialing in public relations and minoring in public admin. I love jujitsu. That's, oh my gosh, it's great. It's great with self-defense. It's great with working out. I love to work out. I mean, I love to feel good and working out helps me feel good. I love to go to the beach. I mean, who doesn't love to go to the beach? Hello and half a day Guam. My name is Aria Antoinette Perez Tyson. I'm 19 years old and I come from the beautiful village of Varagata. My charity is the Guam Memorial Hospital Volunteers Association, uh, also known as the Pink Ladies. I chose them because I kind of grew up at the hospital. My mom works there and anyway, I can give back to them. It's kind of like giving back to family. The biggest motivation for joining this pageant would probably stem mostly from my struggle with the idea of beauty when I was growing up, when I was younger. I had an eating disorder and made me lose a lot of weight to the point where it was unhealthy and throughout that whole experience I was unhappy with my weight and I was uncomfortable with who I was and from that I just learned um, the value of loving yourself and this pageant is um, treating it as, a, as an opportunity to be a role model to young ladies and grown women to just express their beauty and more than their makeup or the way they look. And I go to school at UOG, I plan on majoring in biology, and I hope to pursue something in medicine, hopefully physician's assistant. I like running. Um, when I was in high school, track was my thing. And I'm into rugby right now. I'm part of the women's rugby national team. Buenas and half a day, I'm Kalexi Pereta. I'm 16 years old, I'm from the village of Jigo, and the charity of my choice is Guam Cancer Care. I chose Guam Cancer Care because I lost my grandfather and my Nina to cancer, and I felt like it was a personal story to me, so I wanted to work alongside with Guam Cancer Care. And their, their charity is about helping to get rid of cancer and they, the way they take care of their patients is like they're treating them like family. I decided to run for Miss World Guam because I always wanted to make a difference and being a part of this pageant, it gives me a greater opportunity in doing so. I come from a family of five. I have one younger brother and one younger sister. My parents' names are Vanessa Preta and Jermaine Preta and I'm, I come from a huge family. I plan on going to college and majoring in law and as my minor into the performing arts because that's always been a passion of mine. 
I always watch like criminal investigation movies and I find it so interesting. So I was like, wow, I think I want to be a lawyer. My hobbies are dancing, singing, swimming, and spending as much quality time with my family. Hafade Guam, my name is Athena McNinch. I am 17 years old from the village of Nilao, and my charity of choice is American Cancer Society. Ever since I was a little girl, my dad would always take me to Relay for Life, and that's one of the things that, you know, made me decide I want to do the American Cancer Society. I decided to run for Miss World Guam because I believe that I can be a strong ambassador to the people of Guam and show the loving Hafade spirit towards one another in the international pageant as well as on Guam. And also I want to be a role model to young girls so they can look up to and be like, I want to run for Miss World Guam one day just like she did. As a child, I always thought of myself as, you know, ugly, nothing special. I thought I'd never get married. I thought I would never do any of these things. And I thought I would never do a pageant, and I think a lot of girls experience that where they think, oh, I'm not, you know, I'm not like her, I'm not, you know, beautiful in any way. But then I overcame that, and now I'm doing this pageant, and I'm, I never thought I would do that. And so it's kind of amazing to me to realize, wow, that's one of the things that really changed my life is going through that phase and overcoming it. At the moment, I am attending the University of Guam, and my career goal is to become a lawyer. I love singing, I love acting, I did plays. I love, what else do I love? I love reading books. Uh, my favorite series are Divergent and Hunger Games. I absolutely love those books. Stay tuned, we're just warming up. We have many more contestants to introduce you to. We should add the contestants are wearing swimwear and accessories out of the SM store in Hagatnya. Stay tuned, we'll have more after the break. My favorite fruit are persimmons. And they're all the way from Japan. I first tasted them here in October. They're seasonal. And they're just sweet. And they have a nice crisp, but nice sweet center. My favorite fruit is pineapple, and I prefer the ones in Hawaii, they're really sweet, so yeah. My favorite fruit, well, I love strawberries, they give you energy, it's a great pre-workout if you want to be natural, so that's why I love strawberries. 